monstrous was here to discuss about the Pratibha Karanji. And then I went to the school campus to find out whether all arrangements have been done for the independence day. By the time Bhavya came down with the parents and I asked, why did you come? And she said, it's her birthday. <laughs> I forgot to call her and wish her. And post lunch, when I was entering the school campus, I heard one man in, in khaki dress, he's an auto rickshaw driver, standing right inside the school and screaming at the school principal and the teachers and big noise. I asked my people, who is he? And they said, uh, he's one of the students' parents who has come to ask why the teachers scolded their child or beat the child. So I went and asked him, you have no right to enter my, my school campus, my, my, I said, my school campus. Stand outside and put up the application, letter, complaint, whatever you want, you have no right. Shouting, screaming. I asked him why, he said, one teacher has taken a scale and hit the child. So I told the school principal, you have no right to beat any child or school any child as per the Indian laws. And not only the Indian laws, around the world the laws are there. But in Japan, also the laws say no teacher should beat the child, school the child, but not a single child will leave the school campus if the teacher doesn't whack, give them a whack or, or it is not, they don't call it scolding, the teacher did not shout at me. Shouting from the teacher is like taking us forward. Even after I get 100 marks, even if I do the homework properly, perfect also, teacher say, motto, motto, a little more harder. Gambatik kudos a little more harder. Work a little more harder. When teacher doesn't say that, the child will sit and cry after the class hours. Teacher has got a long big cane, which is put up a string and cut into pieces. And you whack, pow, you can hear the sound. Every child, every grown-up person, even in the in the karate world also, there are fourth and fifth then members sitting and crying because their master did not whack them. Now, whacking means master has put his energy into you, master has observed you. When master has observed you, then you had it. You have you can take it forward. You have the battery charge. Can you believe? And if that thought was there. The Japan, the smallest country has become the, one of the greatest economic might on that one thought. Fidel Castro said it does not matter how small you are. If you have faith and plan of action. First of all, there is not that you are small. The feeling that you are small because you got disconnected. Whenever you are in connection, they always say husband and wife is one, father and mother is one, grandfather and grandmother is one, you and nature is one. Jiddu Krishnamurti said, the, the moment you lose a deep intimate relationship with your nature, deep intimate relationship with your nature, then diseases, confusion, then other talks. Temples, masjid, churches becomes very important. Fidel Castro said, it does not matter how small you are. That's what the whole of the Indian society understood. If you have faith and plan of action, faith and plan of action is not very important. But it is important for the materialistic world because they got disconnected. The whole of Indian society has taught the Indians that their family is very very important yes even if companies and factories are not there they don't have a job but if you have a comp family which is together the whole world will follow you you become a magnetic force the whole companies and schools and colleges and factories have become a magnetic force to pull in funds from around the world because all the household people reach us and that is the energy around the world. If they can create an energy force, they are small if you are not there. With you going there, they became big. 
Fidel Castro said, it does not matter how small you are. Please try to understand this one point. Whenever you are together, a one person can rule like a thousand man warrior. When you are together, husband, wife, and your two children, four children together, four thousand people rose together, work together, love together, practice the Sanskriti, and then connect to your chikri called your family tree. To your joint family, there stands called the family tree. And in the joint family, there are hundreds of people. Joint family is hundred. In the family tree, if you look, there must be minimum 800 or 1,000 people into 1,000 times. Where is the small? When you count on your family, that your husband, wife, and small, you think the husband is small, wife is big, or wife is small, husband is big, small, other two children. No, you say four, one, two. You never say the husband is one, wife is half, and children are quarter, and half of that quarter. You never say how many people are there in the family. If the husband, wife, and two, they say four. You never say they are one end of uh, one end of or two. The small, it doesn't come because you're all your strength together is a powerful movement, a magnetic field. To have that magnetic field, Fidel Castro said, you, have, you if you have faith and plan of action, the faith comes because when you're together, you feel somebody's holding on to the hand, like the husband holding on to the wife said on the wedding day and she feels that's a power he feels that's a power she feels not his power he's connected joint family the family tree is a huge amount of energy passing through her it's like a massive big electricity passing through him to her and when he touches her her family her joint family and her family two massive 800 800 000, 2, 000, Family members, can you believe? So you are not. Where is the faith? Fidel Castro said, if you have faith, this faith in you is very, very important to avoid diseases and to make you the richest person in the world. You are rich, but you have gone, you went blind, not able to see, not able to hear. Just wipe off the dust from the mirror and have a look. You can find out it's a powerful force behind you. If you have faith and plan of action, and then plan of action comes when you are together. You all plan together. When you plan together, every time is an action. Throwing water, fresh water, stagnant water, stinks. Action. Every time you feel energetic and action. When you disconnect from your hand, when you disconnect from your family, husband on one side, wife on another side, I always tell my children, when your husband is talking, don't interpret, don't interfere in media. So he might have told me, look, yesterday we made so and so. And wife said, no, no, not yesterday. It's day, day before yesterday. I said, no, 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 no. Don't need. You go together. Both of your voice, whether he put a little masala, never mind. It depends upon the circumstances. Whether she put a little masala, depends upon circumstances. Never mind. But talk in one voice. When you both talk in one voice, your children talk in one voice. Then you can see the family, your whole family talks in one voice. Then the joint family talks in one voice. Family tree. The world will be shocked. You are a power base. The Japan was a small country. It became a magnetic a power, a economic might in the world just on this one thinking. If you can know to connect, to hold it, you will slowly start understanding that you yourself has got a power. Power of understanding the Sanskrit and practicing the culture. Early morning you practice the bhajan, the prayer, and you can see, wow, the body is getting healthy. You created the magnetic force. You created the battery charged. Then you stretch your body. And your eyes and the ears and the nose become so powerful, which disease can enter in the body with the flowing water, is fresh water. And then you move to the line and you, what is medicinal plant? You know how to talk to the birds. You know how to talk to the animals. You know how to hug the trees and look into the sky. Far away into the sky to see the stars and the moon and the sun. You are a power base. Fidel Castro said, it does not matter how small you are. If you have faith and plan of action, forget about the small because you are together if you connect it.
I told this auto rickshaw driver, you were telling one of my teachers called the child and bet the child. Did you tell me the truth? Did you ever scold your wife and beat them? And in front of me, he was threatening his daughter. <laughs> now it's like a year. See, you never threatened. Don't even take a flower and beat your wife. Don't even scold your wife. She has got so many pains. She left her family and came and joined you. Please catch hold of her hand. Give her a kiss morning, give her a kiss in the evening. You think you kiss saw what? <laughs> they got disconnected and they are living in fear. Fear creates diseases. Let us avoid it. Just look into you to find is yours the best. Yes, you are the best. Yours, everything in yours is the best, including your husband, your wife, you are the best, but hold on. Never interpret, never dissect. Together you talk in one voice. That time you understand yours is the best. Thank you.